How you doing? I'm fine, thank you. And yourself? I'm good. You're in New York? I am, yeah. It's quite a place to be at this point in time. How's it going? It's going good. A uh, little bit tense, a little bit humid. Yeah. A little, little bit crazy, but you know. Have you seen any of the action that we're watching on television? Oh, I've seen a few protests that, like walk down my street. Um, I was watching some stuff. Uh, NBC had like a helicopter in the air the other night um, with the people walking over Manhattan or Brooklyn Bridge. Did you see that? Yeah. That's, yep, yep. that's pretty crazy. I didn't know what was going to happen there, but it seemed <laughs> to be all right. Um, I've not seen any craziness, man. I mean, I'm still quarantining myself, so. Good on you. <laughs> That's a way to be. This is a good time I, to be quarantined. <laughs> I think so, too, man. I'm, I'm worried that this is going to really exasperate that, th that, you know? Yep, yep. Who knows what's going to happen? It, it just, it's not a good thing any, any way you look at it at this point. No. But, <laughs> <hopefully>. <laughs> Do you wish you were in New Zealand? No, actually. I, I, I actually... I, I even told my wife that I'm actually happy to be in New York. Uh -huh. I'm kind of ha happy to be in the thick of it. I mean, I love New Zealand, of course. And, and there's an element of me that would like to be there. But I don't know. Like you say, it's quite a moment in time here, you know. And, um, and I love the city a lot. So to be here with the people of it is, is, is kind of, I kind of like that. Because that's what New York's about, you know. Like This is true. You know, it's yep. a good community here. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, absolutely. I've got some friends that back there still, and I hear from them constantly, and they kind of feel the same way you do, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. just looking out for everybody. So uh, so what's the deal with this new uh, new song you got out? Well, um, I've been, uh, since, since lockdown happened, uh, I've been kind of compelled to record more than I usually do, which is a lot as it is. Um, uh-huh. I, it's, I mean, I, I just, I can't do anything else. So I'm, so, so I'm basically, it's all I've got to do now. So I, I guess that song just kind of popped out. Um, you know, it's about the whole sort of COVID-19 thing and not being able to touch people and shit like that. I mean, right. I, I, you know, a lot of my neighbors have had it. Um, I, I even, I haven't been tested yet, but I'm going to be in the next couple of weeks. I think I had it. I'm not sure. I mean, I was in China like in December, so. It's possible. Um, I, I do remember uh, losing, uh, uh, getting sick, and then and then getting better, and then getting sick again, which never happens to me. Right, and right. One of the things. But anyway, who, whatever. Um, you seem well yeah. now, so that's good. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm alright. Yeah. Um, so yeah, the song just kind of popped out, and then I kind of um, I thought it would be great to have a female singing with me. Right. Kind of back and forth. I thought we'd just take it to the next level. So I got Kate to do it, and 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 then Alyssa came up with the. My wife came up with the video idea. So it all I love kind the of video. Just, the video. Did you shoot it yourself or edit it yourself? I edited it myself. Yeah, I made it myself. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, impressed. <laughs> I, I, I do everything myself with my own stuff. I I um I come up with the concepts for all the videos. I do all of the artwork. Um, I record all of the music myself. I play all the instruments except for the drums. That's why I give it my own name. Because, right, right, yeah. And I've got a lot actually in the pipeline at the moment. It's going to be a steady stream of things, uh, you know, throughout the next while. <laughs> so give us a hint as to what we can expect. You can expect um, a, uh, a seven-inch EP. You can expect two albums and that's yeah. just that's just what i've done so yeah. far <laughs> I've, I've, I'm still, not much i'm still working on some some more stuff you know just just kind of just right you know yeah and was it is basic rock and roll or what were what kind of thing are you doing working on yeah i mean it's, it's basic rock and roll i mean you know it's basically me you know what i mean it's 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 right. stuff that i'm into it's uh every day when i'm not touring I'm, I'm always in my studio and and i have a huge list of ideas uh on my phone that i'm if i see something hear something or come up with an idea i always just write them down on my phone and then i'll come into the studio and i'll try them out every day and and some work and some don't and um i don't really care what kind of music it, it is i'm always trying to kind of like 
just do what I think is would be really really cool. And right, right. And that and that and that often turns to be out to be like high, high energy rock and roll, I guess, in some respects. But I, I don't going to limit myself to anything. But that's just what I'm into, I guess. You know. Well, it's good to see that you're putting this uh, kind of time that you're spending on your own to good use because a lot of people are just letting it they're just making sourdough bread or something and that's about it <laughs> hey uh don't get me wrong there's a lot of sourdough bread going down in this household too yeah, oh, good. i was just excited i got a new uh recipe for pizza to make uh that turned out perfectly so oh uh, yeah, yeah. That. nice yeah yeah um so and of course uh, the folks back here know you from the D4 and, of course, A Place to Bury Strangers. You guys were, you know, our regular resident or visitors. What's going on with those guys? Anything? Or I, I actually left the band right as this hit. I, I was in the band for 10 years and I, uh, yeah, I quit um, yeah, pretty much the day the quarantining happened. Really? <laughs> uh, well, what, yeah. What brought that on? Hmm. Various things. <laughs> uh, I don't, stuff I can't really talk about at the moment. Okay. I don't right. really get into, but um, it was time for me to move on, you know, and um, and I'm really happy I am. And that's why I'm just going to concentrate. I'm going to concentrate on my own thing for a while. It's been a long time coming. I think it was a bit of a sign for me to do my own thing, you know. It's like, right. you know, you know, I want to do what I want to do. You know? Yep, yep. And it's interesting. I mean, I'm kind of going through the same thing here at Sky because they're making a bunch of us redundant, mm -hmm. changing things around. And it's, it's like, it's, are you making this ch uh, decision on your own? Or are you having it made for you? Either way, it's usually for the best. At least you, you have to think so. Oh, yeah. I, I always find it's for the best, even if it doesn't seem like at the time. Yeah, I mean, all the bad, what I would consider maybe the bad things that happened in my life or whatever, have led me down other paths, and it's all turned out to be really good. You know, yeah, yeah. I, th I think you just got to keep the positive. You just got to keep the positive mindset, and you, you know, I must say I use um, what what's the word for it? Uh, creative visualization. I kind of visualize things, and and then just kind of like aim towards them and try to make them happen and they usually do you know? right right um and any chance of seeing you on this side of the pacific anytime soon <laughs> i mean i realize that everything is kind of up in the air yeah i mean i'd, I'd love to come down I, you know i was actually right in the middle of getting a band together to play a couple of shows here in new york with my own stuff and i was really excited about it because i wrangled like just the, the, my dream band together and uh ah. so that that kind of got put on hold um i don't know how long it's going to be before um you know i'll be able to play music and again live here mm -hmm. at least um so yeah i mean I, I would love to get down there sooner than rather than later but who knows when that's going to be yeah they're just i mean things are kind of lightening here because we've only got one case of covid in the whole country at the moment so uh we're we're able to have some gigs but uh, obviously there's not a lot of international stuff going on and uh, mm -hmm. keeping the, the borders tight so who knows when uh, it will come back to anything yeah. close to normal well maybe maybe that's a good, maybe i maybe i'll come play there instead you know i won't be playing here for a bit so yeah, yeah. they are working on a bubble between us and australia so you can kind of go back and forth there there we go. Yeah, um, <laughs> I think we're just gonna. I'm just gonna spend this time doing other things at the moment. Like, I mean, I've always loved playing live, and I've done a lot of touring. But I'm really kind of over the last few years, we've really been excited about recording a lot more than I used to be. So, right, and even making doing other things like making art and like uh, you know making the videos and things. So I think I'll just focus on that for the moment. Yep. Well, I love the video. So. Make some more of those, and we'll, we'll be happy until you get <laughs> over here. <laughs> but good to see you again, and good to talk to you. Yeah. Be careful in New York. The whole place is going up, it seems like, sometimes. So stay indoors. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we're still around in a few months, yeah. Okay. We'll see you.